We are back with some more Colts franchise. We're coming off of the Phillip Rivers 2-0 start and playing pretty damn good if you ask me. But here we are, Jacob Eason going into the starting lineup. Um, the accuracy is are just his accuracy stuff is just so much worse. I mean, in the 80s and 70s when Phillips up here in the 90s and 80s, um, throw power is the mainly the only difference is 93 to 85. Um, obviously, he's got a little more speed on Jacob Eason. He's 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 the younger guy, and we'll see. I know some of you guys in the comments were saying you got to develop the rookies, you know, especially with you know you get you just you're wasting the whole season. I could still focus train him in the background. And start Philip for a year and then roll with Jacob. Um, but we'll see. We'll see. We're going to go into it. I'm going to be pass happy. Obviously, if we decide to roll with Jacob in, um, once the league starts, I'm not. I'm probably going to try to rely on the run a lot more than if I started Philip. Um, but we're going to give Jacob, you know, as, as much throwing opportunities as he can in this game. I might take some, just some shots deep just to see, you know, how his deep accuracy is. Even if they're covered, I just want to throw it deep and just see kind of what happens. Um, but he will get, get in the start in these next two games, trying to see what we got to do. And the, I did want also in this franchise is to talk about people who we have to re-sign. Um, so the way we do it um, is we don't go off with the fair offer for certain players. So every 85 overall and up, we have a ca our own calculator that's built. Um, so that way, star players get more money than you know than what Madden asked for because Madden asked for in most situations asked for. Um, just stupid contracts. So the first one up um, is T.Y. It says 57 million, but in the contract that we use, it'll probably be a little bit more than that. Uh, but I do have to st uh, stick with how many years. So is it worth giving T.Y. a four-year deal? At um, he's at 87 now, so he'll probably be. I mean, he'll, he'll be starting to decline here pretty soon. He's already 30. I'd be open to it, but it's it's a tough call. It's a tough call. Um, let me know what you guys think. I know you know Colts fans are probably going to want to resign T.Y. I'd, I'd be down for it too. I'm not sure what the calculator number is for TY because he's, he's 85 and up, so I have to stick with that. Every 84 and down, um, I have to offer a minimum of the fair offer. Um, every 85 and up, I gotta, gotta go through the calculator. So, TY, not sure on him. Um, Justin Houston, another one. He's, he only wants a two year deal. Um, it's really not too bad, but we'll just have to see what I think were what the. Um, Regression hits him at the end of the season and what it looks like for him might just be drafting a defensive end not too sure um, Marlon Mack I'm definitely walking. I'm not I'm letting him walk. He can go to free agency do whatever he wants We got Jonathan Taylor. We got Naeem Hines. I don't even got to worry about him Ryan Kelly must resign. He's 27 85 overall. I want him back So he will definitely definitely be getting resigned Malik Hooker another one hundred percent getting resigned. I'm hoping he stays under the 85 overall so I can keep him at a cheaper deal than if he bumps up to that 85. Phillip, I think I'm gonna let walk, especially even if even if I start Phillip year one, I still think I'm gonna let him walk um, afterwards and roll with Jacob or something. Trey Burton, um, I think I'm gonna let him walk as well afterwards. He's on this one year deal, so I don't think I'm gonna resign him to some fat contract. Autry, I'm probably gonna resign. Pascal, I'm not sure. Xavier Rhodes. Um, not sure. Anthony Walker. I mean, these are guys that are just some backups. Mo Ali Cox, I definitely want to resign. Like I said, he's 26, but I was hoping to develop him. Honestly, I thought he was a little younger. I thought he was 24, somewhere around there, but he's just so tall. I mean, he's huge. He's a big guy, so I thought it'd be cool to develop him, but I don't know if I have time. We'll have to We'll have to see, and then we got some back, some backups back here. Um, but let me let me know what you guys think about some of these higher guys. What do you think we should do when the league actually starts? Especially these two right here, Ty and Justin Houston. I could go either way. Marlon's leaving. These two, I'm 100% resigning. So don't even, don't even worry about your opinions on Ryan Kelly, and Malik Hooker. I'm Malik Hooker. Just wait for wait till we get the strong safety on this team, man. The the safety duo that I got is gonna be nasty. But let's hop into this game with the Jets and Jacob Eason. The Jets ball carrier. What a man up outside there. Play action. We got this right here on lock. On lock. Oh, yeah. Who's that? DeForest Buckner? Okay. I don't think he's got a sack yet on the season for us. There we go, man. Good D. Good D. Let's uh, let's roll up and uh, let's go like this. And then who's blitzing? Darius. We'll just put you in a little zone out here. Let's lock up. Quick little three and out. Come on. Uh-oh. Get there, Kenny Moore. Get there. Let's go. 
Let's go, man. Eason it is. Eason it is. Let me switch like this, yeah. Let's do this. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, my God. Look at Eason go. Throwing dots all the way down the field early. Okay. Eason out here slinging it on first down. That's what we want to see from the man. Okay, okay. Uh-oh, another accurate throw. Let's go. I don't know what's happening, dude. Easton might was looking like the truth. <laughs> this man is coming out slinging it. Look at this dude go. We got a touchdown. It makes it. Oh, three, dude. Three for three. All accurate. This is crazy. I mean, you saw me with Phillip. Not, I'm not saying Phillip was bad, but, I mean, we were struggling a little bit. It was We weren't scoring that much. We were playing from behind for the most parts of the game. But look at Easton go. Three plays, three completions, and a touchdown. Oh, come on. Get in there. Get in there. Oh, let's go. Give me that, man. Great play, guys. Good shit. Kenny Moore and whoever I was the user. I don't even know who I was the user, but good shit, guys. All right. Let's see if it was a fluke or not. Jacob Eason back on the field. Paris. Ooh. Okay. There's the accuracy right there. Inaccurate. A little bit of accuracy issues. I knew that was going to become, you know, accuracy problems coming into it, but sucks when that happens. Good catch. There we go. Hey, Jacob's looking nice, dude. I'm not even going to lie. The man's looking absolutely brilliant right now. Oh, he's got a cannon. He's got a cannon. Oh, my. Look at that. That was a dot. I mean, an incomplete pass, but a dot. Third and 13 is going to be tough. I think I'm going to keep Jack in, too. We'll just see if one of these three can get open. Sending heat. Uh, I, hey, under pressure, an accurate throw under pressure. I mean, I can't ask for better than that. I mean, I really can't. Yeah, yeah, we're creeping in. We're creeping in here. Run it. I'm coming. Good tackle. Oh, no. Thank you. I thought I had a touchdown. Juke made no sense whatsoever. Dropping back in the zone here. Oh, I should have blitzed that outside guy, but I don't got time. Fortunate. Yeah, wide open. Oh, I tried hit sticking. Hit sticking seems hard. It's really bad. He might be getting seven on this drive. He's struggling right now. Yeah, look at him go. Look at him go. I'm trying to strip it and hit stick, and I'm just keep missing. They are on fire, ladies and gentlemen. Absolute fire, this this New York Jets team right now. Oh, good throw. Okay. Well, nothing I could do there, man. Just straight down and got seven on us. I mean, it was everything was working for him on that one. Hate to see it. I'm, I'm kind of happy for it, though, because we get back to Jacob. I, that's why I, I want to see Jacob throw. He's doing great so far. All right. Back on offense we go. Let's go. Good throw to T.Y. Great throw. The man can absolutely sling the rock. That's for sure. Who's got crazy throw power. Not bad. Well, shit. Third and ten. This one's going to be a little difficult. Just a little difficult here. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Dang it. I saw it too late. Hines was getting open, man. He was running by that dude. It's gonna be it's gonna be difficult to get turnovers in this mad. It really is. It just I feel like it's gonna be much 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 harder. Oh oh my God! As I say that, Malik drops it. Dude, Malik's dropping user picks. That was my first actual legit user. I mean, I've read I've read the whole play, and Malik just straight dropped it. Like my one of my best defenders dropping that shit, dude. That's fucking crazy. You can't trust anyone out here, dude. I was going to blitz, but fuck that. That's not looking promising at all. The blitz is looking the opposite of promising at the moment. Dude, 
I just, I can't guard the CPU. I'm just going to blitz him because I, I clearly can't do anything right now. So we're just going to try to send heat and make something happen. Easy. Wow. I, I can't. I, it's. I can't. Defense is tough this year, man. It's gonna take a while to get used to everything. I mean, it's definitely gonna take some time. Especially the change of direction is huge. I mean, I. Not, I'm not. Don't get me wrong. I like it. I like not being able to cover the whole entire damn field with the linebacker. I think that's amazing. I think it's amazing that if you're guarding someone and they break out and you break in for just a half a second, that you can't get you can't get back in that play because you chose the wrong way. I think that's amazing. It's just it's just gonna take a lot of time to get used to. Put we put Hines on a wheel route. If we got time, that might get that might get open. I was hitting B. I was gonna let Michael Pittman try to make a play. Ah, that's tough right there. Third and 19. See if Paris Campbell can run by everyone, maybe. Or Hines. Oh, hey, that's a that's a good throw. I mean, I. I thought, I thought throw, only Philip can make throws like that, but I mean that's a good throw. Nothing was open on that one. Put T.Y. on a curl. He's tired, but let's see how we can throw curl routes. Oh, a guy ran out there to help him. Okay. Okay, that's not a good throw right there. That's one. That's just a bad throw in general, but it is inc it is inaccurate, which is oh he's gonna get a pick six, isn't he? That's just that I'll take I'll take fault for that throw, but that's also an inaccurate throw. I mean, it's not the best decision, also inaccurate. That that's where we're gonna get ourselves in trouble if we do stuff like that. So I'm I'm not too worried about that one. I mean that's just a throw I can't be making at this point in time and shouldn't even be making in general. Alright, Eason. Now's the time, man. Now is the time to shine. A good throw. Paris, wide open. Let's go. I'm going to go up tempo. Let's go up tempo a little bit here. Second and 18 now. Not good. That's not good, man. TY's open, though. Let's go, TY. There we go. Third and 10. I'm going to put TY on an out. We'll smart it. I'm also going to put Hines over here to block because that guy off the edge is looking a little scary. Make that throw. Yes, let's go. Third and 15. It's going to be difficult. It's going to be difficult one here. Fit it in. What a throw. And he dropped. Oh, he caught it. I thought he dropped it. Okay, Michael Pittman. Thank you. First career touchdown. I've been struggling to get this man involved, but I thought he dropped that. It looks weird. I'm not sure why it looked like that, but I'll take it. Alright. Lock in, boys. Lock in. Lock in here. D up. Wide open. Uh, why, why do I try to hit stick? I, you, they just, they're not as good this year. All right, can we get a nice little? No, I think it's three. I think they got a first down earlier, but still, we get we get a good field position. Wide open. Oh my goodness, ugly! What a hit by Malik, but ugly. We gotta get a stop, dude. Or else we're not gonna have a chance. Getting our asses dotted up right now by Sam. What's up with that? Oh, I missed! I missed, dude! Oh my god, the hit sticks are so weird! I can't land a single one! I don't know how I landed that one just to play ago. Oh my god, I cannot hit him. I don't know what it is, man. I can't fucking land hit sticks. Touchdown. I said I run committed like crazy there. Jeez, man. I gotta take hit sticks out of the. I mean, I already hit stick too much, anyways. But it, it's it's a lot harder this year. I don't know. It, I don't know if it's a change of direction that's fucking me up, but I cannot land them. Third and four. Third and four. Big one. Pittman, good catch. Let's go, man. Damn. Third and sixteen on this one. This one's gonna be tough here. It's gonna be tough. Third and forever. 
Oh, make the throw. Yes! Let's go! Thank you. We had that, too. Just did not make it. Let me put Hines... Actually, reset it. Let me put Hines out wide. I'll just put him on a little slant. Good throw. Oh, no! I thought I had it! Oh, my... I thought that was easy, man. Bradley McDougald. Oh, my goodness. I thought I could fit... Maybe if I, I low-passed it, I think it would have been fine. I thought I had that. Guess not. Well, fuck. <laughs> There's our first loss on the season. I'm not going to blame this one on Jacob, though. For, I like what I saw from Jacob. Honestly, if Jacob plays like this, I'm rolling with him because... He's not, really not doing bad at all. Alright, well, let's see if we can get some more points or something. Make it look a little bit better than it actually is. That'd be nice. Oh, Lord. Throwing out of the sack, and Bradley McDougal has picked us off again, man. Oh, my God. It, I mean, if I wasn't under pressure, I'm, I'm making that throw. I mean, it's going to be a completion, probably. He's gonna, Jack Doyle's going to run right by him, but... The throw out of the sack and goes straight to him. Oh my god. Alright, I'm still gonna pass because I want to see, you know, how he does. And he's playing pretty damn good, if you ask me. I mean, oh. Oh my god. As I say that, dude, Bradley McDougal, okay. Well, I'm running the ball. I'm getting out of this game. I'm getting out of this game. That was the first bad, bad throw that that uh, I've seen Jacob make today. I mean, he's under pressure, okay, but Philip probably makes that throw. I mean, let's we're just let's just be honest. Let's just call it how it is. Philip probably makes that throw. Third and fifteen. Hopefully, they're probably gonna kick a field goal after this because the CPU just got no sportsmanship, man. Absolutely none whatsoever. Get his ass. There it is. We got smacked, man, and. I think Jacob, the score looks worse than it is, and his stats aren't going to look worse than it is, but I think Jacob played a pretty, he played okay. I mean, the last throw was bad. You can't be overthrowing those. I mean, I get he's under pressure, but I mean, we don't want you overthrowing those. The one, the first pick I have where I'm running around and fucking launching it all the way down the field under pressure, and he overthrows that, I'm fine with those, because I shouldn't even be making those throws anyways, but... Um, that last one is, is, is a little hurts a little bit, um, but his accuracy wasn't that bad. I mean, he does have low accuracy, and I thought it would matter a little more. But um, on these sliders, like I said in the very beginning of the video, though, these sliders are gonna, that I'm playing on now are going to be different than the ones that I'm actually playing on. So it could be worse, could be better. But I really don't think I think three the three picks were on me and the fourth one wasn't really was was pretty bad. Um, Paris Campbell had a good game. Finally got Pittman going. Had a nice little touchdown for him. I want to get him going big time. And, and once the league starts, like that is the main goal. Him, Jonathan Taylor, and if I go with Eason and Eason, those are those are the three of the future. I mean, that's I'm hoping by years four and five, like those are cornerstones of the squad. So. Um, we'll see. We'll see how it is. Um, one more episode against the Chicago Bears with Eason. I might, if I have time on my EA Access, I might play that Week 5 game against the Cleveland Browns um, with Eason out there just so we can get some more playing time with them. But um, I know Eason lost big time, and it looks bad. Phillip came in clutched up on those two dubs. But I I think I'm I'm... I'm pretty close to leaning back towards Eason. The first two games, I was really feeling Phillip. I'm not going to lie. But we'll see how he does in the Week 4 game. And I'll see you guys then.